Zoning was officially made legal by the Supreme Court case of Village of Euclid v. Ambler Realty Co., otherwise referred to as Euclid v. Ambler. In 1922, the Village of Euclid, Ohio made an ordinance to create zones for where land use could be built. Ambler Realty Co., owning 68 acres in the area, sued the town for taking their land without due process. After all, some of the land they owned could no longer be developed into industry for a large profit, but instead residential. The Supreme Court found the rules to be neither arbitrary nor unreasonable, and instead made to improve public health, safety, morals, and public welfare, and so sided with Euclid. Now called Euclidean zoning, land uses are separated into their own zones, such as residential, commercial, and industrial. It was applauded at the time for improving health by removing polluting industry from housing areas. Today, Euclidean zoning is critiqued for spreading out amenities, homes, and workplaces, creating more car-dependent and, in some cases, more wealth-segregated communities.